Welcome to Trek Tuesdays, a weekly series that will look at different aspects of Star Trek Bridge Crew. With each entry, we'll look at individual roles and game modes to provide a bit more clarity than a traditional preview might provide. For this week's entry in Trek Tuesdays, we're looking at the Helm role. This position is in charge of controlling the ship's movement through space, and you can kind of think of it like being in the driver's seat, which shoulders a lot of responsibility. I'm going to turn and then fly because reversing is too slow. As the helmsman, you can control not only the ship's speed, steering, and direction and close quarters movement, but also line up trajectories for things like impulse jumping, which is kind of like a short range warp drive, as well as long range warp jumps. All right, coming up on approach. All right, almost in range. Evasive maneuver. Helm is really the only role in Star Trek Bridge Crew that feels like you're always active doing something. No matter what's going on, whether it be combat, exploration, or something else, you're probably in charge of guiding the ship somewhere. Adjusting speeds, changing course, tweaking elevation, and surveying the map will take up your time when you're not following the captain's direct orders. I make it so when I want to. When combat hits, that's when the action really ramps up. Since the tactical officer to your right needs to maintain steady fire on all enemies, you'll have to be sure that they don't manage to flank you or flee from the fight. Ships don't exactly maneuver quickly given their size, but you'd be surprised by how intense battles can get. Wow, there's the boom. We did it! Other than flying around space, dodging mines and other ships, and tracking down enemies to take out, there isn't much else going on for the helmsman. Conceptually, it's probably the easiest role to learn from a pure mechanical perspective, as steering and maneuvering is something most people are familiar with already but it's not exactly ideal for the easily distracted of your crew. Five-eighths of our crew is in red. I very, <laughs> very much worry about our chances. When playing without a full crew, Helm is one of the positions that definitely needs constant attention. I found myself needing to take over that chair more than others just to make sure we were staying mobile. Sitting still in the middle of space, surrounded by enemies, is a terrible idea. And that concludes today's Trek Tuesday look at the Helmsman position in Star Trek Bridge Crew. Make sure you keep it locked at UploadVR.com for all the latest on Star Trek Bridge Crew and everything VR. Check back next week on Tuesday for our newest look at the Engineer position in Star Trek.